Hey, Journey family, welcome to day two of our 21 days of prayer. I'm Pastor Nathan Ironside. This is my lovely wife, Mary. And our prayer focus today is peace. You know, our world seems to be filled with everything that is the exact opposite. Fear, anxiety, depression. But in Isaiah 26, 3, it says, You will keep those in perfect peace whose minds are steadfast because they trust in you. This verse shows us that peace is not just an emotion. If it were, we could provide our own. But it is impossible to produce something so wonderful as perfect peace. Thankfully, God doesn't expect us to do that. Yeah. Isaiah says that God provides the perfect peace we long for. But that doesn't mean we don't have a part to play. That's right. God's peace is conditional. It actually is. Isaiah places two prerequisites in this verse. He says that God keeps us in his peace when our minds are fixed on him. And when we trust in him, that means that his peace is always predicated on trust. So if we want to see an increase of God's peace in our lives, we need to increase our level of trust in him. So what level of peace will you say you are experiencing right now? If it is not where you think it could be, Ask yourself, who or what I'm placing my trust in. Nathan and I would like to pray with you yeah. right now. Yeah. And as we do so, allow the Holy Spirit to bring God's peace into yeah. your life. Yeah. God, we thank you for your yeah. perfect peace that passes all understanding. We want to walk in your peace on a daily basis yes, today. We are determined to trust in you so that our minds stay focused on you. No matter what is going on around us, we trust you. Have our minds focused on you, Jesus, and walk in the peace that only your spirit gives. Yes, Lord. We receive your peace today. Amen. We're so glad that you're here with us in our 21 days of fasting. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow for day three of 21 days of fasting and prayer. Be blessed and stay in peace.